Hi everyone, Jorge here from Smart BSD Tech Review. Today I'm following up on the first video I created about installing 3CX on the Raspberry Pi, and now I will show you how to receive landline calls on your cell phone. This was my goal for getting 3CX installed, and now you will be able to do just the same. If you haven't checked the first video, it is linked in the description below, and all hardware you will need for this project is also there. First thing we are going to do here is to add either a gateway or a zip trunk. I decided to go the gateway option just to do something different and see how it works. The IP you see here is the one you should configure in the ground stream. Everything else looks good to me and now I'll just rename the generic device to reflect the HD813. I got this ATA from Amazon and the link is in the description below in case you want to buy it. Let's set up the grand string now in order for it to talk to 3CX. Scroll all the way down under the basic settings and use the same user ID assigned by 3CX when we created the gateway. The zip server is going to be the 3CX IP and the port is going to be the default port. Now we need to change a few things under the FXO port section. The primary zip server is going to be the 3CX IP, so we need to put it there. Zip user ID and authentication ID are the ones created by 3CX when we added the gateway. You can add your name, but this is an optional step. Scroll all the way down and change stage method from 2 to 1. I also changed the number of rings from 4 to 1, and this will allow you to receive calls in the app after the first ring from the PSTN network. Now we need to install the application on the cell phone, go to the Apple or Google Play stores and search for 3CX. Once you open the app, it will ask you for permissions, allow everything and scan the QR code located under the user extensions you want to provide access to 3CX. At this point you have a full functional 3CX installation and apps working but this is only working on your local network. If you want to receive landline calls on your cell phone everywhere, you need to open some ports on your firewall or place 3CX in a DMZ. I will show you both methods next. I am using a Linksys router, but the steps should be similar for other brands. Under security, apps and gaming, single port forwarding and port range forwarding, Take note of those ports you see on the screen and add them to your configuration. I tried several other configurations, but in the end, this is the one that worked for me. We can achieve the same by placing 3CX in the DMC. Under any IP address, you will place the machines you need the DMC to communicate with. In this case, 3CX itself and the ground stream. Under destination IP, we'll use 3CX, which is running on the Raspberry Pi. I hope this video was useful to you. If you have any question, let me know in the comments below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. That's it for this video. Drop a like if you enjoyed it. Get subscribed for more awesome content and catch you guys in the next one.